while our cats may be eternal kittens in our eyes, knowing how old they are can help us provide the best care. Animal Wise explains more as we look at how old cats are in human years. Kitten. This stage is the equivalent of the first 10 years of a human's life. During their first month, newborns are fed exclusively with breast milk. Weaning onto solid food begins at 4-5 to five weeks, starting with wet food or moistened kitten feed. The first three months with their mother and siblings are a vital stage for learning behaviours and boundaries. Ensuring we meet a kitten's needs is imperative for health and well-being, so we explain what is needed in the first info video we share. From two to seven weeks of life is the period of socialization. This is an important phase in which we must get kittens used to situations such as traveling in a carrier, interacting with other animals, getting used to noise and visits from strangers. Hygiene is also very important. Sterilization can be performed at this stage to reduce the risk of developing disease. It is also important they be examined to determine their health status and provide their first vaccinations. Adolescent or young cat. This stage of a cat's life covers their first seven months and two years, corresponding to around 11 to 27 years in a person. This is the equivalent of their adolescence and youth. At seven months old, they are practically adult size and sexually mature. These cats are already strong and playful, with lots of energy and a desire to explore and play. If they've not been sterilized, hormones begin to do their thing. When sexually mature, this leads to the heat period in female cats, which includes loud meowing and general frustration. Males will often fight with others and try to escape in search of females. Both will mark territory. They will also need assessed for booster vaccinations at this stage. A cat's diet also changes with stages of their life cycle, meaning we have to adapt their food to their age and specific circumstances. Playing and interaction are essential to avoid frustration, unhappiness and behavioural problems. Young adult. The three to six years of your cat is equivalent to a person of about 28 to 43 human years. Cats at this age already have their personality and behavioural traits. Checkups at the veterinary centre never hurt. Behavioural problems derived from sex hormones will continue to appear as long as they have not been neutered. At this stage, they will start to want to play often and their energy will remain high. Learn more about cat development by watching our next info video where we explain when a cat stops growing. Mature. This stage is equivalent to a person of between 44 and 59 years of age. Cats of this phase progressively reduce their energy levels and desire to play, devoting a little more time to rest. If we don't continue adjusting their daily food rations, they can gain weight. Once they reach this stage, it's important they have at least one veterinary checkup per year. It's also important they always have water at their disposal, preferably a water fountain for cats to encourage proper water consumption and prevent issues such as kidney disease. Senior. The period of 11 to 14 years of a cat are equivalent to 60 to 75 human years. At this age, cats tend to rest a lot and play much less. It's common for chronic diseases to develop or worsen. It's essential they have at least one annual veterinary checkup and they should go whenever any symptoms of disease appear. From this age, serious health problems such as tumours become more frequent, which can reduce their quality of life and life expectancy. Geriatric. When a cat is 15 years or older, it corresponds to the last years of a person's life. Cats at this age can suffer from chronic bone and joint diseases such as osteoarthritis. It is also common for them to develop neurological disorders such as dementia, which can manifest in nocturnal meowing problems and behavioural issues such as urinating and defecating outside the litter box and hiding. Veterinary checkups should be frequent, especially in sick cats, and the diet should be adjusted to their new needs. If you want to continue learning about cat health and veterinary advice, don't miss the playlist we share here. At what stage of life is your cat? Let us know in the comments and we'll see you next time.